Welcome back to ADHD Whiskey. My name is Matt. Today is the 22nd day of December and the 22nd day of the Minnesota Whiskey Elite Advent Calendar. Let's see what I can do with day number 20 friggin' 2. America. Day 22 is a melted alcoholic caramel that you look at and wonder if it's going to be delicious or if it's suspicious and not going to be good. So you just spin it. Dang. This Bourbon Junkies Glencairn swirls this whiskey maybe better than any Glencairn I've ever seen swirl whiskey. Time to investigate. Mother. Hmm. We're doing it again. Just this time I won't drop it. I'll actually hold it there so I don't drop it. I'll just hold it. Or can I let my finger go without dropping it? Okay. The color is so light and the nose was so soft that I need to cap it to find out whether or not I can trap some smell in there. I gotta, I gotta trap the smell. I wonder if I swirl it with the cap on. Oh, that's a new trick. That's a new trick. Friggin' look at that. Suck on that. I have, oh, I have no clue what, the nose is, well, wait a minute. Welch's grape juice. It's very light. And I had to put my nose in it and just just huff and puff the opposite way that the Big Bad Wolf did because he blew the house down. I'm trying to inhale the bourbon up. That bonehead right there on the TV, that shook guy, the Dan shook, he once gave me a sample of rare perfection. It's like rare perfection something. I can't remember like what the years were or anything, but I remember when I tried it, I sent him a text message and I said, dude, I get like really strong. The only thing I could smell on it was Welch's grape juice, but it was buried. But once I, once I locked onto it, I was like, that's what it is. Welch's grape juice and also like green grape at the same time. I completely forgot about that pour until I smelled this. And then I was like, what was that that smelled like that? It was rare perfection. Very light on the nose, very Welch's grape juice. I don't think it's a bourbon. I don't think it's a straight bourbon from the nose. Down the chimney. Weird. I do. I don't think I've ever tasted that before. This is very citrusy. It's lemon zest. It's orange peel. Super citrus. Pretty high proof, I think. I don't think that this is a bourbon. I also don't think it's a rye or a scotch or an Irish whiskey. Maybe an Irish whiskey. Who knows. This is, this is probably some sort of like blended American whiskey is my guess. Like, um, you know, like a light whiskey or just an American whiskey. It coats the mouth pretty well. There's even like some like tropicalness in there. Like a little pineapple and like a slight bit of coconut. The proof is hard to judge. Maybe between 100 and 110 maybe? Um, man, this one's got me utterly confused. I don't think it's finished. There's toffee on there too. A little bit of toffee. A B, I give it a B, and it's not bad. It's actually, it was pretty enjoyable. So let's find out what the heck it is. Let's dig into it. In this case, I'm, I'm fairly confident that it's not a bourbon, that it's some sort of American whiskey. 
Day 22. Oh. Okay. This is... Barrel Bourbon. It's, it's bourbon, I think. Barrel Bourbon Batch 14. Nine year, 109 proof. It's distilled in Tennessee and Kentucky. Weird. For a nine year bourbon, that was different, huh? It says bourbon whiskey on it. I'm so stupid. All right, that's fine. That's fine, there it is. That's what it is right there. You can see it right there. My name is Matt, this is ADHD Whiskey, and like I always say, keep your head in the clouds, but your mind on knowing that there's only, there's only three sleeps left until Christmas. So you better get your shopping done or look like a total idiot come Christmas morning. And remember, the stores close early this year. They're not open 24 hours. They'd be shutting them down. Get all your PlayStation 5s. Get all your ginormic trampolines. Get all your 6,500 inch TVs. 